All right, what is going on, ladies and gentlemen? It's VMP here. Welcome back to a little more Blood and Steel. And today we potentially have a pretty big day for ourselves. Um, last episode we went on an absolute tear and took over. I don't even know how many castles. I think it was like three, maybe even four castles from the Nords. Um, what I do know is they are down to just Sargoth and Curran Castle. That's all. Well, hold up, let me. Yeah, that's all they got left. So, uh, today, the goal is quite simple. Take every last remaining fief from the Nords so that their lords can no longer spawn back in. And then from there, I can work off camera and slowly eliminate all the lords, but right now, we need to take these last two out. So, um, with that being said, current castle here, 875, not too bad. A lot of the enemies are back here in Rizzi. Yep, back there in Rizzi. Um... There's also a decent amount up here. More than I was expecting, to be honest. Alright, they are following us. That's... Hmm. A little troubling. Okay, is he going away now? He might be going away. Alright, so let's uh, quick try to run in on Sargoth right now. See if they're going to let us. I mean, they might actually. It only takes us two hours. One hour. Two hour. When? Oh my god. <laughs> oh, we might be able to pull this off, boys. Don't even, they're not even going to try to sally out against us. This is perfect. I can tell our Aleph's. We only have two Aleph's with us right now. I did lose a couple. Um, that's fine. We can always go over and pick more up from our other castles. Ooh, sweet. Our Aleph sniped their one. Perfect. It was the opposite last time. They had one Aleph last time that was getting free shots on ours, and ours really couldn't get any shots in. And so a bunch of them, them went down. But right now, I don't know if it's the same guy. Do we just have, no, we have two Aleph's here. Okay. They're doing mad work. <laughs> They're absolutely decimating their lineup here. Okay, so let's reload real quick. Probably should have done that before I, like, crested the edge here, but that's fine. Down you go. Down you two go. Let's move to the side here. Boom, boom. All right, got some dudes over there. Not too fussed about that. So, this is looking good. We've been doing pretty good in these siege offenses right now. The only problem, honestly, a bigger problem for us is going to be just fighting all these guys in the field. Um, that's gonna be very annoying. Um, luckily, I can already tell their numbers are really starting to go down. Whereas before, we'd have a bunch of lords running around with a thousand plus troops. Now we're looking more like a lot of lords in the, you know, two to four hundred troop range. I I'm pretty sure I saw King Ragnar earlier, and he was walking around with, like, maybe three hundred troops. Like, really not that many at all. Um, so that's a good sign for us. That's a good sign indeed. So quick take that out, gotta fight him in the streets. Now this is where we tend to have a lot of struggle, it seems like, recently. Back up a little bit. There we go, we took him out successfully. What are we doing here? Not the best. Not the best. I put no one there. Son of a bitch. Son of a bitch. Oh, we're getting caught out, we're getting caught out. Ah, oh, damn it, they went through our shield. Alright, this might be one of the ones where we have to come back in. In fact, I think that's going to be the case, as they are just dominating our boys right now. Yeah, the Valguards are too good. There's still several of them left. Alright, so let's, let's get out of here. Um, we lost some morale there. That's fine. Just prepare ladders one more time. That first initial part of the siege was great for us, so I'm not stressed at all. They are going to sally out this time. That's interesting. Um... I think I'm okay with that. This will give us an opportunity to kill a lot more of them. Now, they do have the Valguards coming out, so let me remember to stick back. Oh, it's one of the one of the problems with us having so many series going on right now. We got like four of them, I think. Um, is that I kind of tend to forget different strategies that I need to be employing for different ones. Like, you know, because most of the time I charge in. I'm, 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 I want to be the uh, the first one in the battle, but uh, not, not in this series. Not in this series at all. Alright, their Berserkers and Valguards seem to be doing pretty good so far against us. Oh, hello. Nope. Please stop. Just stop. They're so fast. Nope. Oh, please. We're actually losing a few guys here. I'm seeing a lot of guys over here. This could be a potentially good shot. I don't know if they come around. It's not a good shot anymore. Hmm. We need to come back in. What's going on here? Oh, wait, what? Why are all these guys chilling back here? Oh, shit, what the f Okay, hold on. Let's, let's retreat real quick. I'm not sure what was up there. Why did all of, why were all of our guys, um, sitting back there? 
No wonder we were getting our ass kicked. Oh, shit. Okay, well, we can try one more time to fight them here, but we're about to get attacked. Charge in, you fools. Like, all of you, charge in. <laughs> Can't just have some of you charging in here. Even the, even the mercenary cannoneers. All of you guys. No, see, they're getting stuck here. What is going on? Come over here. Do you have everyone free yet? No, they're all sitting back here. I don't know why they're doing that. Hopefully we have enough now, though. That'll be okay. Let me kill that berserker real quick. Mm, the berserkers are going off. Do we need to get some more rogue destroyers, maybe? That's what I'm starting to think. Charge. Come on, units. You're not listening to what I'm saying. It's a little frustrating. There we go. Now it's starting to look a little bit better. We do kind of need to win this one, I'm not going to lie. It's kind of imperative. Why are all these guys sitting back here? Get the fuck into battle! These are a bunch of melee units and rogue destroyers. What are they doing? They're just chilling back here. Good god. We could have had this whole <laughs> town by now if you guys weren't doing god knows jacking off back there. Fuck's sake. We about done yet? Three more of them left? Because, I mean, these these Nords are bad enough. Like, they're, we already struggle enough with their melee um, guys, but it, when we have, like, half of our army sitting back and letting the other half get demolished, it really, it really is not helping our case here. All right, there we go. So that wasn't horrible. Um, let's lead our guys in. What do you mean you're sailing out again? I don't... <laughs> you shouldn't be allowed to do that. Oh, my God. All right, still 210 of us against 105 of them. Can these guys come forward this time? Why? Why? What is different? Why are they doing this now? I'm, like, really confused. Move. Tell you what, I'm gonna tell all the like mercenary cannoneers to go over there. All the infantry and infantry and whatnot to go this way. And I guess archers can show over here too. All right. Well, luckily at least it seems that most of their Valguards are dead. They do still have berserkers running around that are kind of being a pain in the ass. Like this fucker right here. You did not die to that. Two point blank shots with the dragon. You didn't die. Okay. I thought it was only the battle guards that could do that, but uh, I guess I was mistaken. Get the fuck out of here. No patience here. No patience. You go. Come on, come on, come on. Nice, nice. Okay, this actually turned out. Yeah, this, this was a pretty good battle. I don't know how many troops we have left. Um, it's enough that, or not enough to scare off that invading army. Although there, that invading army was pretty big, so we'll, I guess we'll have to see. Um, hopefully we have enough that we can just keep on going and wiping out the garrison. Even if we just have to do it through them sailing out repeatedly, that should be fine. Um, that should be fine. So what this means is I don't think they're going to try to siege Tyr, which is what we got last time. Um, are you scared of them? Come on, Rogue Destroyer. Thank you. Which means it should get its air auto garrison. Um, we'll be in the clear for that at least. This one might be a little bit tougher for us to hold. Okay, there we go. Finally. Not charging. Okay, only 47 enemies, so this is their last group of enemies. Um, yeah, we should be good. We shouldn't even have to worry about fighting them in the town now. Alright, so things are looking fine. Things are looking just fine. Damn. Blunderbuss man, got a kill from all the way back there. What a sniper. <laughs> what a sniper. Uh, so guys, thanks to everyone who came out for the stream on uh, Sunday. I know I didn't I didn't mention it as much as the other ones because it wasn't it wasn't like a milestone. It was just a random stream I felt like doing. Sunday fun day stream. Uh, might do some more of those from now on. Um, just random weekend streams, because I have a lot of fun when we're streaming. And uh it seems like you guys do too. It's a good way for me to get some work done in on the series. 
um, and for us to all to chill and whatnot. So uh, this one, if you guys weren't there, I don't think I'm actually going to post a video for it. Um, just because it won't make a lot of sense to those of you who weren't in the live chat. And the live chat was not recorded, like you can't read it now. Um, all I can say is there, there seems to be like rising factions in the ranks of the channel. Um, <laughs> and for a summary of it. The, it all started out when I made um, Lemon Juice, who, for those of you who don't know, very generous um, on these last two streams. And uh, overall has been doing a great job of uh, kind of keeping the peace in the chat. So I made him a moderator. And so then people started calling him Lemon Juice, the one true god or whatever, the lemon god, blah, blah, blah. And from there on, we started almost like a civil war among different factions. Uh, from the, There was the Lemon faction, the, the original ones. Uh, from there, the oranges started as a rebellion against the lemons. Then the bananas came around. Um, I want to say there were there were limes, but the limes were more just two people fighting over who was considered the king of the limes. We had some grapes at one point. The bananas had themselves known as the Banana Republic, which I liked that one. I liked that one a lot. That was pretty clever. Um, and then Walrus just up and made himself his own faction, the Walrus faction. He was just like, fuck all these fruit factions, I'm going to make my own faction, and we're just going to be Walruses. Um, but yeah, so, it was pretty fun. Um, but like I said, it didn't make a lot of sense without all the context, and that's what we spent most of the stream doing, was arguing about who was, who was in the lead, who was winning, which faction had the most support. Um, I do think at some point we're going to have to do a, uh, a bit of a battle between the different factions uh like we'll get on like just a, a regular old multiplayer server and have you guys fight it out uh to see which faction is the true faction um because i think that could be pretty fun so we just made a bunch of money off all that shit let me pick up some more food here um yeah this should be good and then we will go ahead and Hire some recruits for this. We didn't actually lose that many guys there. Maybe about 40 or 50 taking that. Really wasn't too bad. So if we do this, um, we should have enough. I think I'm going to move down these mercenary canyons. I don't think they're doing all that much, to be honest. Um, they're kind of just clogging us up. At least that's what it feels like. Uh, sure, you can make that. And make it make it Nordic troops. I actually like the Nordic infantry. Um, we just haven't really been able to use them because their morale is too low because we've been fighting them for so long. Alright, so we'll use some of this. Buy some more of that. Drop them off. We dropped like a solid 400. Actually, I might even up it to like 500. Just because we do actually have like an army on the doorstep right now. There we go, there we go. Uh-huh. And then I think I'll check out the tavern. Do we have any rogue destroyers? Please? Please? Sword Sisters, Foul Hammers. I mean, Foul Hammers are decent. Uh, oh, Jesus. 60 Gs for 85 of you? I mean, I know you're pretty good, but I can't. I'm not going to drop 60 Gs for you. How about you? See, these guys are pretty good, I think. Foul Hammers. 72 of them. We'll take them. And then that should round out the garrison. Yeah, that should be pretty good. So hopefully that'll dissuade any of them from attacking. How are we looking? How many of us are wounded? How many of us are not? Well, I mean, we still have a decent amount, but I am worried about getting caught here. So we're going to run away. Nice. So they're probably going to siege Sargoth in a little bit. Now is actually up. Yep, there they go. Okay. Hmm. Now might not be a bad time for us to go in and take Curran Castle while they're not paying attention. Are these guys really going to try to find me right now? <laughs> Give me a break, man. Come on. Surely you guys. They must have thought that they were going to get some reinforcements, which uh, they're definitely not. <laughs> they're definitely not. I just got left to die. Sucks to suck. Boom. Some big, some big sprays there. Nice, nice. Turn this around. Uh, let's do a little bit of this and this. Why are we getting most of the kills? Where are my troops at? Well, I guess the Alphs that we have, the three Alphs that we still have are kind of wounded. We might pick up some more. Um, <laughs> look at that guy just slowly riding up next to us, just like, what's up, bro? And then we just dismantled him. Get out of here. 
Thank you. Nice, nice. Alright, so we'll finish off these two. And we should be out of here. So the thing is, do we want to stop at one of the castles? Um, hmm. That's a good question. Uh, I'm not sure. Which are better, the elites or the experts? I think the experts are. Matchlock, sharpshooter. Well, we'll pick you up just because you're an expert. Alright, looking good. Got any good loot here? Eh. Couple okay things. I'll take him just to sell him off. All right, so let's see here. Um, Telrog Castle. We should be able to take one out of there. Then maybe we head over to Current Castle because there are some kind of guys walking by right now. But see, a lot of them are really weak. A lot of them are pretty weak. I mean, every now and again, you have one that's decent. Um, but a lot of them are weak. So tell you what, we're gonna quick head over to. Oh shit, they're just taking Sargoth right away. Fuck. Well, that didn't take too long. I tell you what, we're gonna go over here. Gonna get the garrison. Give me that Aleph. Give me the Blunderbuss men. They have a lot of Blunderbuss men. Like, possibly too many now. Um, hmm. Well, I mean, shit. <laughs> We're going to use them. Okay, so let's head over here real quick. They're going to take... Uh, I'm sure they're... No way. Is he going to get there in time? Lady Mytheld? Okay, they took it real quick. That's fine. Let's go over to Curran Castle. Okay, this guy's going to fight us, but... <laughs> he only had one tiny lord join him. I am perfectly okay with this. Oh, shit. Damn, they're Alphas. Sniping the shit out of us. Where, where the fuck is he? Oh. Shit, they're there. Why couldn't I see them before? I'm, like, blind. Where are the rest of their troops? Am I, like, going crazy right now? I don't see the rest of their troops. Oh, there we go. Hitting their Alphas pretty good, though. This should finish them off. There's one down at least. Where do we have to hit him again? I think it's like right there. Where? What? Where are the rest of their units? I thought I said they had 100. Okay, well, you are both going to be my prisoner. Er, well, okay, only one of you. That's fine. That was very strange, it felt like. Okay. Whatever. So I'll take this. Thank you very much. And let's go. Oh my god, look at all these scrubs over here. <laughs> oh my god, we're about, we're about to kill, like, what, four lords here? Perfect, and none of them can fight. None of them can fight. So wait, is the battle just over? Do we win? Shit. This might be weird. Um. Okay, there we go, we won. You are my prisoner... You are my prisoner. Okay, so we got two more prisoners. That's good. Um, and they're going to have to wait to respawn back in. All right, so let's quick take current castle here. It is a ladder castle. One, two. Oh, this guy wants to fight us. God damn it. Hmm, okay. Well, tell you what. Keep our archers up here. Canneers over there. Infantry can charge in. I'm gonna go forward and try to snipe their Aleph, if at all possible. Do outnumber us pretty decently here. We haven't leveled up in a while, it feels like. We're getting kind of close. Only 180,000 more experience, which for this mod is not that much, but... Whatever. Whatever. Damn, they're spawning hella far away. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, what the fuck? They're so far away. <laughs> oh, um. Do we even want to take this freaking battle, man? What are, what, are these, what are these guys doing? Why are they so far away? Okay, I really just want to snipe their Aleph. If we can snipe their Aleph, we'll be fine. Hello. Hello, Mr. Aleph. Goodbye, Mr. Aleph. You're all very nice. Who do you, who do you think you are? You out. Oh shit, I didn't see all the guys down here. Oh, it's this map again. Why, what is up with these ginormous maps? I'm not trying to, like, this is just one guy. It'd be one thing if it was, like, a huge battle against their entire faction. So we want, like, a big map to really do a lot of battle strategy on. But, dude, I'm just trying to finish this dude off real quick. 
Once again, taken out of context, that probably sounded a little weird, but we're no, we're just not gonna not gonna talk about it. <laughs> we're just not gonna talk about that. Alright, there we go. Good shots there. Alright, so let's pull away here. Got our infantry starting to get here, man. I'll tell you what. You and you come over like there -ish maybe. That way they kinda get a shot on them. Let's see, they took out, uh, what, Ferentis was it? So these two are still going. Oh, Bundak is out here with his crossbow. We should probably change that. He he should be, I mean, he should be good theoretically with uh, guns and whatnot since he's a crossbowman and it's the same proficiency. There we go. Some good shots here. Yeah, I feel like we're winning this so far. It might get a little difficult once our rogue destroyers come in. We'll see if they're still... Well, the problem is that our rogue destroyers aren't coming in all at once. Okay, we're about to kill this force. God damn it. <laughs> God damn it. Alright, well, we got the rest of our guys coming in now. Oh, Jesus. And we're about to go down. Yep. <laughs> yep. Pretty much. Okay. Um, let's tell you what, we can just go ahead and retreat from here. Gain 59 morale, not too bad. Alright, so let's see. We don't want to fight this guy. Really not trying to fight this guy. So let's see if we can lead him astray. God damn it, now we have all these guys. Mm, I don't want to be going this way, but I guess we're going to. Get back to tier, maybe. What are these guys doing? What's his? It's this guy again. You're all farn. Get the fuck out of here, man. I don't have time to be dealing with you. Alright, we're going to head over to tier then. Maybe it is time for us to uh, to start using some of their own units against them. Even if the morale is awful. I feel like we just got way too many blunderbuss men here. So uh, let's pick up some of the Valguards. And put them at the very front. Ooh, we're almost out of Vega Praetorians. Wait. Oh, okay, no, I was thinking of Vega Crushers. Yeah, that's 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 right. Um, let's quick hit up Jabagi Castle, and then we'll come back down and try to take these last two. I think we should be able to. I think we'll be fine. Let's give me another Aleph, so we're up to f six of them. Um, let's get these guys, let's get these guys. Bunch of Berserkers, bunch of the Valguards. We know how brutal they are for the enemies. Hopefully they're just as brutal for us. I know we're going to lose a bunch here. Ooh, the Holy Army is actually at war with us. I mean, it's not surprising. We're not exactly the most honorable. And holy shit, one of our caravans has 700 troops. All of our caravans have 700 troops. Oh, no, 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 no! Okay. Why? What are you doing? Leave me alone. They aren't nearby. I'm telling you they're not nearby. What are you doing, man? What are you trying to do here? Trying to... What the fuck? Yo, leave me alone. Bro! <laughs> this dude is... Do, do we have to talk to him? What the fuck? <laughs> I, know, I don't know what to... I don't know what to do about this. Um, do I need to, like... Because we can't even fight them. They just don't like us. What is it saying that they're doing? Are they saying that they're following us? Yeah, it says that they're following us. Huh. How fast are they, man? They're so freaking fast, too. Uh, Alright, Wilhelm. Hold up. Let me go turn on cheats real quick. Oh. Oh. There we go. As soon as actually I loaded back in, didn't even have to do anything. It changed to traveling to Derkuba. Interesting. Not sure why I did that, but I'm not complaining. All right, so it looks like we've got basically the... Oh, god damn it. No! Okay, here's what we're going to do. We're going to get a quick teleport right here. Pink. Going to let him hopefully travel back to Derkuba. Hold on, let me turn on vision. Who? Is he... Are you actually traveling to Derkuba or are you traveling to me? What are you doing? Okay, we're going to let him run away and then we'll teleport back to where we were. 
Oh, he's following Lady Mathalia. Yeah, so the, the, they don't like us here. Okay, so anyways, teleport ba right back to where we were. Okay, we should be good now. We should be good. That was very strange. Um, all right, so let's quick try to take out Kern Castle, and then we'll go for um, Sargoth. Then I think we should be done. Uno, dos. Tear's been besieged. Okay, we got to do this quick then. One, two, come on. Let's go, let's go. Let's fight. Let's fight, let's fight, let's fight. <sighs> okay, ouch. That now hit us pretty good there. Okay, let me just aim for him right away. Keep on stunning him. He's hurt, he's hurt. Finish him off. There we go. He's done. Okay, nice. Right, hit some people up there. Elves land in some decent shots. How many of them do we have spawned in? Ooh, it looks like at least five. That looks good to me. Looks like we have those. Yup, our berserkers are running in. That's awesome. Okay, that's just what we need. Oh, man. See, isn't it so much nicer now that we have them on our side? Oh, my God. This is glorious. We just have to kind of watch their morale. Uh, and by watch their morale, I mean just use them up quick before they all desert us. Because the morale is going to be shitty no matter what. Because we're using them to attack <laughs> their own towns. They're definitely not going to be happy about that. But that's fine. As long as they keep on performing like they're performing right now. <laughs> I am A-OK -okay with that. A-OK. -okay. Alright, let's keep it going. Let's keep it going. Jeremy's level 33. Jesus, man. I, we very rarely get heroes that high of a level in any series. Like, not even like Prophecy of Pandor. Come on, there we go. Snipe him. I'm thinking there's a few more up there. Yeah, definitely a few more up there. We'll go finish them off. We'll reload this real quick. Let's keep it smoothing. So let's see. We can quick take this thing, run over to Sargoth, take that back, and then um, potentially go in for tier real quick and try to stop them from taking that. Uh, probably not stop them from taking it, but at least retake it from them. Did this one Berserker kill all these dudes in that short amount of time? Holy shit. Okay, that was a good call. <laughs> Us picking up those Berserkers, man. <laughs> Just jump and headshot him. Get wrecked. Um, that looks like some enemy units. Get some enemy units over here. <laughs> I don't know how much help I can really do. I'm worried about shooting our own units here. Okay, that, that was a good one. Took out a couple of their Val guards. We got... Oh, Jesus. This poor Aleph is just stuck. Got a couple more over there. God damn. We need to stop bringing Alephs into these. <laughs> okay. Good battle. Good battle. So that was a real quick siege of that castle. Um, take some more loot. There we go. Um, give this to Lady Mathalda, actually. Well... No, we're actually going to take it, and then we're going to give it to somebody. Um, we are going to give it to... To who? Um, that's a good question. Alright, Amira, let's level you up first. Um, you're just our intelligence girl. So... Oh, wait. Reset. What is... What's going on here? Your first aid is... Six. Why can't we increase that? Is there... Am I, like, blind... Am I missing something obvious here? Oh, your charisma. What am I? That's what I'm. <laughs> I don't know why I thought she was intelligence. Um, she does have good intelligence, but she's not primarily. So she, she, yeah, she's our good persuasion leadership. Gotcha. Okay. Uh, heroism. We're still doing with you, right? Oh, you got that up to ten too. Perfect. Girl, you're working it. Oh, we can get prisoner management up. Um, yeah, you can actually get some good prisoner management. And that's actually a party, because that's some party skill in this one. Perfect. Okay, start doing that. We will start doing that. Good job. Um, Ferentis, buddy, I mean... Oh, you're a looting guy. Okay, we're keeping you. Jeremus, you're a healer. Bunduk, we don't really have any uses for you. So, you are going to be given uh, this one, the current castle. There you go. You're welcome, buddy. Uh, do with it what you will. Should we station this with some couple troops? How much, how much money do we have? We don't have a ton of money, so we're not going to do that. We're just going to quick take Sargoth here. Fucking shit, how'd you find me again, you bastard? 1,000, 2,000. He keeps on coming back to us. Leave me alone, man. <laughs> Leave me alone. 
Alright, we're moving, we're moving in. Did they sally out? I don't even see. Yeah, they sallied out. Okay. Well, let's go in. So we got our Berserkers charging in, our Val Guards. They should perform a lot better now. Ooh, okay, just fucked up one of our friendly troops. My bad. My bad. Come on, charge in, boys. Our infantry are looking a lot stronger now with those additions. Um... Ooh, that was a juicy shot right there. We're about to get a couple more ones. Oh, oh, nice, nice, nice. Look at them fall. Look at them fall. They're all clumping up. None of them got shields. It's beautiful. Exactly what we want to see as a shotgun user. Right, let's try to get some of these guys back here. There we go. Got a couple of them. Oh, man. Alex just had a rally right there. Fucked him up pretty good. Down he goes. Let's try to get them. Alex reading us to it. And just like that, okay, <laughs> it was pretty good. <laughs> that was uh, it was pretty good. All right, are we uh, kill feeds faded out. I assume it's there. We go, battle one, nice 35 renown lead in an assault. Looks like they're not even gonna try to oppose us this time. Not gonna try to sally out. Oh, we do have our elves going in here. Oh, oh yes, elves, keep it going. I want, to see some, I want to see some more just like that. God damn, yeah, the Berserkers are so fast, man. They're using their own weapons against them, and I freaking love it. I, I almost want to see if we can get, like, maybe about a couple hundred Berserkers, maybe, like, close to a hundred of those, um, those Valgars. Uh, we'll be at the point that we can almost start trying to take on large armies of uh, Nords, um, like multiple vassals. Um, just because we'll have massive Alf support, we'll be providing fire support personally. Gotta take them out. Uh, these guys are hardy. Just taking a couple Alf shots here. And actually living to tell the tale. Well, okay. <laughs> they didn't live lo for too long to tell the tale, but you get my point. Alright, here we go, here we go. So we just got a few of these infantry left. Jump shot. Okay. And the only damage done was to ourselves. Perfect. Hello. Goodbye. Whoops. Okay, probably just... Yep, just knocked out that Berserker. Whatever. Good battle, man. Okay, now here's the true question. Can we finally beat them into town without weakening them first? I think the answer might be yes. I think we might be able to do it now just because of the Berserkers. Oh, God damn it. Why do they always go after me? Leave me alone. Son of a bitch. Don't fuck him up. Down he goes. Nice. Yeah, this looks way better. Oh my god. Supplementing these guys into our army is the best decision we've made in this series in a, in a while. Since getting... Probably the best decision since the, uh, the, the dragon shotgun. That thing will always be our best decision, because that took us from getting our asses kicked to... Oh, they have an ally left? What the fuck? Well, when the fuck did they... Why is the ally not in the other one? Oh, he's gone now. A bit of a waste of an ally. GG, baby. We're getting close. Now we just gotta clear out the castle. And then I think the Nords will be completely out. Of thieves, at least for a short time. They're probably going to take tier back before we can go over there and try to prevent that. Um, but for a short while, they will not have any thieves. Which also means um, all of their lords that are spawning back in will be spawning back in at tier. And so, like we saw before, we, we, we took down, like, what was it, four lords that didn't have any troops? They had just spawned back in? Easy spawn camp. <laughs> Easy way to spawn camp. Right, here we go, here we go. Boom, headshot, got you. Almost done, who's left? We're even trying to kill right here. Seeker the slain, and we're done. Alright boys, good job. Good job. Getting tons of renown here. Okay. Don't really need any of that. We'll take the loot though. Awesome. Um, go ahead and give this Sargoth. We'll give it to the Bundark. We'll give it to the Bundark. Just to be nice. Okay. Perfect. So, let's... 
I don't think they've gotten their money back since the last time we came through and sold a bunch of stuff off. Uh, we can try to see how much we can get out of them here. I mean, we didn't loot. Okay, we did loot a decent amount. Whoa. I can keep the change. What is that sword? Godenak. Holy shit. 105 speed, 111 reach, two handed, 155 cutting damage. Oh, wait, hold up. I gotta. Yeah, we gotta keep into account what. It, take into account what everything else is, and that is. I mean, it's good, but it's not. It's not that crazy. In any other mod, that would be like, good god, that's insane, but no, it's not that crazy. Um, okay, okay. Byzantine flamethrower. Still want to try that out at some point. I'm sure we will. Okay, let's uh, go to the tavern. Is anyone new here? Skirmisher, Fellhammer. Well, Fellhammers. They're fairly cheap. Maybe they'll be okay. Maybe this will be okay. Let's tell you what. Drop these guys off just for a sec. Um, and we'll hire. Well, let's say like three hundred. Ah, we're almost done with this war. Let's let's not fuck it up. Let's do a full four hundred. Um. Yeah, just to kind of dissuade any lords from trying to take that on at least for the time being give it an attempt or give it some time to restock hold up oh shit holy uh, uh, holy army i don't know what it's doing but i really don't like it <laughs> whatever it's doing i don't like it okay we're still actually we're actually making money every week which is kind of insane um this guy so they're still at tier they're sieging it they're gonna take it um this guy you're all fine i don't even know what he's doing i'm not trying to fight him though um, just because it's been very annoying. Okay, so we lost. Honestly, we didn't even lose that many troops out of that group. I was expecting a little more. Lady Mithalib was a little hurt. I wonder if she actually got into a fight with What's-His-Face, the Holy Army. That's possible. Uh, I'm going to give up some of them. Get some more Valguards. Get some more Berserkers. Buff our numbers up. 633. I think we should be ready to go. We're up to, or back up to six Alephs because we must have lost one. All right, let's head over to Tyr. Let's see what we can do. I'm excited. Okay, they're still fighting Tyr. Curran Castle's been besieged by this guy. We kind of need to stop that, don't we? Fuck, he's going in right now. Oh, it actually did get its garrison. It's probably going to actually survive that. And it looks like Bundok's going to go in to try to stop him. Perfect. All right, let's go over to Tyr and see what they're looking like right now. I'm sure it's not good. Yeah, they're almost done. They're almost defeated. Oh, man. Hmm. Hmm. 87 out of 415 left. Do we go in here? If we go in here, I mean, what? how many are we up against here? 4,500? Nah. There's, I mean, we can't take that, right? Nah. No, no, no. So let's say what. We're going to go over to Rust Castle. Um, pick up some more units. Even more units, I know. And then... Okay, y'all, Turgar, where are you getting these troops at, bro? <laughs> where are you still popping around and getting a thousand units? That's what I want to know. <sighs> where are they going? Where are these guys going? we got to be careful here, actually. So let's evade him. Go into the castle real quick. Garrison, give me the Aleph. Give me the Valguards. Okay, so, um, all right, let's go in from here. Let's see if we can't, they're hurt, they're definitely hurt. Let's try to outrun him here, I think we can. Okay, lost a few units there, about 26, but we have way more than that, so I'm not worried about it. So we are going to run into tier real quick and take this on, and then at this point, they're not sieging anything right now. I think we can end the episode off with us controlling everything. And I think it'll be in a good place. And now we can look at actually trying to take down some of those lords. That Jarl Turgar is kind of fucking with me right now because he has a thousand units. I mean, he alone has like probably about a fifth of all their units. Um, if it wasn't for him, I might actually consider going on and trying to take on one of those big clumps. 
of uh, of Nordic vassals, just because a lot of them only have like 200 or so. And with these new berserkers, I'm feeling really, really confident. Uh, maybe too confident, but go Get that out pretty good. Oh shit! Wow, man, we got fucked up. Oh, we took some mercenary cannoneer shots. I was about to say, I was like, I didn't think we were losing that many hit points. But we took 80 damage <laughs> in the span of like one one second, all from the same uh, cannon cannon shot. All right, but our guys are doing good. Our guys are doing real good here. The new berserkers um, are definitely definitely going to work. Oh, King Ragnar, I think it's time for you to call it a day. I think it's time for you to call it a day. Ooh, that must have exploded like right in front of our camera here. Yeah, they're running in. <laughs> the Alps are just marching. Oh, this is awesome. Let's run down. We got, I mean, just these amount of guys over here. Come on. A couple people. Just run over here. Push these guys off. Whoops. What the hell is going on with this camera? Ooh. Do I have to do it like this? There we go. <laughs> Valgar just like, oh my god, it's too easy for him. Too easy for him. Perfect. Good job. In the town. In the town. <laughs> It's crazy that this is still so early on in the series. Like, aren't we... I don't know what episode this is. I want to say it's only like... We're not even on 10 yet. I think this might be like episode 8 or something. That is absolutely insane. We've done so much. And I think now that we're basically going to be done with the Nords, um, I think we're going to move on and try to take out... Honestly, I might just go down and try to fight Darkness. I don't think any other faction is going to pose nearly as much of a threat as the Nords did. We kind of started on the hardest one. Um, besides maybe the Dark Faction. I think we're going to try to take on them. I think it could be pretty could be pretty fun. Pretty interesting. Uh, so let's see. I've still got plenty of units left. I don't think we've been losing too many. They're just taking their time. Sweeping through. Still got a bunch of these guys over here. But none of them are the, uh, the good guys. So I think we're fine. I think we've done it, boys. I think we've done it. Oh, uh, so, yeah, I think after this, if we just go down, um, have a big final battle with Darkness, and then maybe go up and fight Wilhelm in the big final battle against uh, the Army of Light, so we, we will have killed both. Um, and then we can probably, you know, wrap the series up there. I, I mean, I told you guys, didn't think this was going to be a long one. It's kind of just a crazy, hectic one. We're advancing super fast in it. Um, Basically, we could easily take the rest of Calradia, but it would get repetitive towards the end, I'm sure. And honestly, already is starting to get a little repetitive, fighting against the Nords nonstop. Um, so yeah, I think I think a good way to end the series would be to uh, fight the various armies of uh, Light and Darkness um, and finish them off. Boom. Alright, final battle. Move around here. Phew. Hello. Get out of here. Who was that? Was the Longbowman? Really? You're trying to fight me. Look, I'm sorry for shooting you, mate. But chill out. What are you? Oh, no. Okay, you're trying to fight this guy. <laughs> That's trying to kill me. Thank you. <laughs> uh, my bad for shooting you, mate. My bad. Come on. Come on. There we go. Perfect. All right, well, we're going to go ahead and end this one off there. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Pretty good episode for us. Um, in between episodes, I'm going to do my best to take out these uh, remaining Nord vassals and hold down the kingdom. And then next episode, I think that we can go ahead and uh, push out, push down. Are we going to... Oh, I think Lady Mathel deserves this one. There you go. Take it. Um... We're going to push down and actually start looking at trying to take on the uh, Army of Darkness. Or maybe we should go for the Army of Light at first. Maybe we should go for the Army of Light. Let me know in the comments what you're thinking about that. But we're going to end it off here. So, anyways, as always, guys, take it easy.